Hey, what's going on, y'all? RJ here with CV Tech, and tonight I want to be doing several speed tests here uh, between Boost Mobile and Verizon Wireless. Now, on the left, we have the HTC One A9. On the right, we have the Moto G4 Play. So let's go ahead. Uh, looking up here, you'll see I got um, right at full LTE here on Boost, and I have full service 4G LTE here on Verizon. So let's go ahead here and run this test. The Wi-Fi or the uh, GPS is on on both devices. So you're going to see uh, what we're going to be getting here tonight. And Verizon seems to be struggling right here for some reason on this test. Wow, I can't believe that. Okay, so uh, Boost Mobile uh, pretty much took that one at 58.17 megabits download and 10.7 uh, megabits upload, while Verizon was struggling at only 2.8 megabits download and 8.86 upload. Uh, we'll do a few more tests and a few more spots, and uh, so just stay tuned. Okay, everyone, so I'm back now with the second spot to run the speed test. As you see here on Boost Mobile, I do have full 4G LTE, and on Verizon, I got what looks like three bars of 4G LTE. So we'll see how this stacks up here in this test. So it looks like the Boost Mobile is going to take this one here uh, with a 55 ping on Boost, 39 ping on Verizon. Upload speeds is going to take it as well on Boost. I'm sorry for the shakiness of this video. But there you have it, y'all. Uh, Boost Mobile. 42.05 megabits download, 17.93 megabits upload, and 14.86 download and 2.66 upload on Verizon. I'm in a very good coverage area. Not really sure why Verizon is not full service, but hey, that's the way it goes. Um, so we're going to get another spot here. We're going to some more tests, and so let's head on over. Okay, y'all, so I'm at the next spot. Uh, for these tests now I'm gonna go ahead and say I'm not picking certain parts to do these tests um, You know, I'm just picking random spots and running these tests to see how they run now up here on boost mobile You'll see that I have near full LTE on Verizon. I got three bars of service of 4g LTE These are supposed to be in the best spots So let's go ahead here for both carriers so let's go ahead and run these tests they're on their own servers they're all searching searching for their own servers but it looks like that that boost mobile is just dominating tonight and it is 1 49 a.m um, so it's really off peak times but i will run one with the same server to see the difference but wow 76 megabits okay you can go ahead and go away now uh 76.3 megabits download and 14.54 upload on boost and 18.73 uh, download and 4.30 on verizon i'm very surprised at this let's change the server and run one more test here Okay, so I have changed the server, so we'll test again, and as you see there, I'm on the exact same server for both devices, and it looks like that it's holding us on right at 70 and 20 on Verizon. So 70.29 megabits per second download. 
and 12.9 megabits per second okay start over again 40 on the ping 70.29 megabits per second download and 12.90 upload on boost mobile and 39 on the ping and 20.79 megabits download and 3.58 on verizon so you're seeing the test uh, i'm gonna do one more test out in the country we'll see how that turns out and i'll be the last test okay y'all so last test i'm out here in the country and it's really dark and quiet out here and as you'll see on boost i have like one to two bars of lte on verizon i got two bars of 4g lte so let's see if verizon can beat out boost in this country test And it looks like the boost is, whoa, suffering there. So it does look like the uh, Verizon did beat out this test here. It started off kind of, you know, kind of decently strong on uh, Boost Mobile. But it kind of went down to what you see there. And so Verizon is already done. And we'll just wait now for Boost to get done. As you see, right here in this spot, boost is getting literally almost nothing in the upload department so the last test you'll see it there the download is point zero point seventy nine and upload is zero point zero one on boost mobile and nine point twenty nine megabits download and four point three eight upload on verizon so this here shows that out in the country boost is going to suffer a little bit now different parts of the country could be different but right here where i'm at boost is suffering this kind of does show though that verizon does have a stronger connection in the country areas um, so these are just random tests and random spots here uh, boost mobile versus verizon wireless um, this was helpful and informative in any way now i'm going to go ahead and say this will vary depending on where you live your city your state your phone uh, and everything else so you know these tests are just my test in my area they will vary so anyway if this was helpful and informative in any way hit that thumbs up button i'd really appreciate it any questions or comments leave it down below and subscribe if you haven't i'd appreciate it y'all have a good one and we'll see y'all in the next video